watch and happening right now. Leaders in the state house calling for Representative Steve Lebsack to resign after an investigation reveals 11 credible accusations of sexual harassment. Our Allison Zimmerman in studio tonight in our newsroom with the latest developments. Allison. Robin Elizabeth, we just got our hands on that resolution about 15 minutes ago. House Majority Leader Casey Becker made the announcement this morning. The findings of this investigation are confidential, but Becker says members of the House will receive a redacted report of the investigation. Now, this move could mean a big shift when it comes to disciplining members of the legislature. I think we need to see how the investigations play out, but I think those who know that they've done wrong should step down. A strong message from Pueblo Representative Denea Escar at the start of the session in January. Now nearly 50 days in, no sign of any resignations from members of the House or the Senate. But today... That this body consider, through a resolution for expulsion, that Representative Lubsock be expelled from this body. The House made a move of their own. This is the first such resolution in more than 100 years after an investigation found accusations against Steve Lebsock by five women are credible. I reviewed the report and found the content of the report to be both serious and egregious in nature. On Thursday, there will be a joint caucus meeting with Democrats and Republicans, and then they'll separate and run their own meetings. Lebsock will also have the opportunity to speak before the House votes on the resolution at the end of the week. I've done my best to develop a fair and open process. When reports came out at the end of last year, lawmakers made a call for change. In January, Spring Senator Bob Gardner told us they're not done. We've made improvement. It's not enough. I want to be very clear about that. We, we have more work to do and we're committed to doing that work. And reports on sexual harassment against members of the Senate also continue. Senate leadership has not made an announcement on the consequences for those members. One of the accused, Senator Baumgartner of Sulphur Springs, stepped down from his post on the Transportation Committee earlier this month. And at the end of last year, when these reports came out, we learned the state legislative council had plans to hire an HR position. News 5 confirmed today that that person, Ben Fitzsimmons, who works with Jefferson County, started the job just last week. Rob. Allison, thanks.